Yeah, I think water supply doesn't intend to change the definition. I think what they've said is they, they're going to provide this, um, this projection under a different definition, which gives you a lot, the commission a lot more leeway to determine those water demands going forward. So then this, this water plan uh, demand side is a farce. Okay, again, to clarify, um, if it was in the TOD, but it didn't have land use classification urban, it was not accounted for as a anticipated water demand, because that means at the most highest level of land use classification, it doesn't have authority to proceed. So we didn't include it. And that we felt were, was consistent with the definition of authorized plan use. State, county, community development plan approvals. Right. We threw whatever that we knew of that had those three components within the water demand. So if anything, we probably provided excess of the, the definition of APU. So what if any- It was not a farce. If any of these uh, are headed to approval, at that point, um, is there an intention to amend yes. the water use and development plan before they can be uh, um, entitled? Yes. The water use and development plan is anticipated to be a dynamic document. We've updated it in 2011. We're updating it again. We don't plan to have it be a, an end all at this point. It's a snapshot of what is uh, the information available at this time. But if we do get future updates or future uh, land use approvals, we will amend it.